Another church was vandalized over the weekend in the upstate, this one on Easter Sunday. 7 News reporter Nicole Ford spoke with church members and has an update on this string of church vandalism hitting the area. Riverview Baptist Church is a small church nestled between three counties. When members arrived here on Easter Sunday morning, emotions were high when they saw what was before them. Deacons and his wife, uh, she does a lot of stuff in the church, and when she heard the call and she got there and seen it before we got it covered, she was I mean, she was in tears. Graffiti painted across almost every wall at Riverview Baptist Church. It made us all sick at our stomach. I, I'm not, I mean, for somebody to be that cruel and that mean to do something, especially on Easter Sunday. This wasn't the first time this church was hit. The pastor's son tells me just two weeks ago, the glass was broken out of the cross on the front of their building. Turn yourself in. I mean, the Lord will forgive you for this. Turn yourself in, take your punishment, and go on. Since the beginning of the year, deputies say 12 other churches were vandalized in Anderson and Greenville counties. These churches and, and these buildings represent a place of refuge for people. And, uh, you know, whether they're there on Sundays or throughout the week. Each one with a small congregation in a rural area. Sheriff Chad McBride says that makes it harder to catch the culprit. While many are in similar areas, it's not clear if they are connected. I hope that there's a very, very small number of people, if not one person, uh, that's committing these crimes. But there are reaching throughout many jurisdictions, so you know it could, it could be that there's a couple different groups that are doing this. If you have any information on the vandalism that's occurred in any of these three counties, you're asked to call Crime Stoppers. In Pickens County, Nicole Ford, 7 News. It's not the first time we've seen something like this. Looking back to 2018, four churches in Anderson County were vandalized on the very same weekend. An officer